Hey, it's King of Tech here. Today I'll be showing you guys how to solve a quick problem on uh, Windows iTunes, uh, where when you plug in your iPhone and it's charging, uh, it's just not showing up on iTunes. You don't get this panel here, so you can't sync your music or movies or anything. So this is how you fix the problem. So get right to it. Um, if you have Windows 10, you have a search bar down here that you're going to need to use. Uh, if you're not on Windows 10, just hit the uh, start icon and there should be a search function on the lower left and what you want to do is search for devices and printers on your control panel so this is what devices and printers look like um, you need to scroll down to unspecified and there should be uh, something here called Apple iPhone which is unspecified uh, since my iPhone is being detected it's been replaced with something called Apple mobile device USB driver but if you're having this problem it should say Apple iPhone Anyway, right-click Apple iPhone uh, and hit Properties. And then Properties, go to the Hardware tab. And then in the Hardware tab, hit Properties again. And then in this tab here, go to Change Settings. Then once you've got Change Settings, go to the Driver tab. And it's going to say Update Driver. Now it says, how do you want to search for drive software? Hit Browse My Computer for the driver software. And you're going to want to paste this place in the description. So uh, I'll put this in the description. Basically, this is where your uh, your drivers for your iPhone is kept so the iTunes can detect your stuff. For some reason, the driver has been uninstalled, which is why your iPhone's not popping up. Uh, if this doesn't work, because obviously you may have installed iTunes in a different place, uh, the core idea of this directory is you head over to C, and then you go to Program Files, and then you go to common files, then Apple, then mobile device support, then drivers. And then you hit OK. Uh, if, if you don't find these, uh, you, may be, you may be able to find it on uh, program files x86, which just means you've got a different version of, Windows, uh, a different version of iTunes. Um, so just try that out. So once you've got that, just hit next, and then, you know, for me, it's already installed, but if it's not installed for you, they are going to install it, and then you'll see your iPhone pop up. So if you've got any questions or you're stuck along the way, leave a comment, uh, or else if this helped you out, please like and subscribe. Um, thanks very much.